What's up YouTube, in this video I'm going to be doing the alpha version of Valenosaur Stalk. Now I'm doing this without any dinos, just on foot using my tech rifle and my tech phase pistol. Now, as you can see I'm flying over towards the footprints, I'll start here and I'll speed the video up. Until we get to the first encounter, here we go. This is on an official server so you will notice that there is some lag. And it's absolutely destroying it. Seems to be easier in water because on land he seems to be able to shoot at me a lot easier. In, as in water he, he starts doing the tail whip quite a lot anyway I'll speed it up again to get to the next point This is arc, the minute you're doing something, something else will aggro on you or run towards you or lead something over to you. The tech rifle is absolutely destroying him. Anyway, let's speed things up and get to the next point. What you want to do here is you want to get up in the air, move away from the dinos that are aggressive towards you. You want to lure them into the water and once they're in the water they hardly shoot you at all. You can just shoot down at them. Bring some medical brews if you want. In this video I didn't need them. Tech rifle don't seem to be doing too much damage on these fawny dragons. Try the phase gun. Oh, and I'm trying to use the stun. Let's change that up. There we go. Now with the tech phase pistol, obviously the hits have to build up, so you have to be quite accurate. It's, it's easier with the fawny dragons, but with the dilos, not so easy. When you start this mission you get 60 minutes, as you can see I'm on the last stage and I've still only gone through 5 minutes of gameplay. I should be able to get this mission finished at the 10 minute mark, judging by the way these are taking damage. doing quite a bit of damage now because of the continuous hitting I started this mission with 198 elements so I'm doing quite well change back to my tech rifle because it's doing more damage and with the splash damage on the little ones as well it's doing pretty well 
I actually believe the Tech Rifle is better for this mission than the Tech Phase Pistol. I'm just going to speed things up a bit here. No one likes a long video and I try to keep mine under 10 minutes so... The reason why I'm looking down sight is because of the bars on the side. You can tell if your gun's going to overheat or not. Just need to be careful with that. Little bit of information for you, about three minutes ago Cedric on Twitter posted ready to bash the summer in, rates will go live for all platforms at 1 PDT and PC is planned to go live at 2 PDT, um, give or take an hour and consoles are planned to go live at 4 PT earlier, yay, explanation mark, well basically that's midnight in the UK so talking about information Here's some more for you. Rockwell's innards, if you go inside there and you have the logo for the mutagen in the bottom right hand corner, then that means that there is mutagen around. But there's one problem. If you go too close to the ceiling, because obviously you're hovering in there everywhere you go. If you go too close to the ceiling, it will glitch you up through the map and you will be back outside of Rockwell's innards into the biome. And when you go back into Rockwell's innards, there will be no mutagen, it resets the timer and you'll have to wait for it to start spawning again. If you found this video helpful in any way, please leave a like, please subscribe to my channel and as always, I'll see you on my next video.